happening. It's uh, getting late, about 10 o'clock, but um, I just wanted to touch base with you and tell you what's going on today. Um, my new Ford I just bought, uh, starter went bad on it. I've been stuck at, uh, at Quality Foods all day today. Had a good Samaritan stop by. I had a couple of them. Um, you know, one guy, there was two of them, and they they got out of, it looked like they just got off work going into the grocery store. And they tried to help me jump it off, and it wouldn't jump. We had, I have a little cable, so I, and I forgot my toolbox. You know, I said I didn't even take my toolbox. I took my chain and my rope, but I didn't take my toolbox. And I'm out there with a little pair of pliers, you know, these little needle nose, trying to change batteries out because I got another battery in there. Um, I guess the, they knew what was going to happen, you know, so, uh, <laughs> so that's what it is. I got it, it started at $126, went to O'Reilly's, which is right there, 80 Wendy's. I spent the whole day in the parking lot there, and, uh, they left, could help me, and then, uh, then I had, uh, I had John, John Cash, um, stop by, and it's, you know, it's, uh, yeah, don't don't go don't go there you know I got he might have favored him a lot you know uh, you know it could have been could have favored uh, uh Kenny Rogers back in the day but anyway um uh, he was out there and he he's a good Samaritan and he stopped and and tried to help me he had a nice uh, a nice bag of tools a real nice bag a couple of nice bags and well clean well I mean he was right on time with them things. I hate to get my hands on them because they make it so dirty. You know, they were he kept it real nice, and uh, he helped me. And then when the kids showed up, with they was in a big truck, and they a big work truck, and they showed up. And uh, these guys are from they're they're young kids, real young, you know. And they know, man, they know a lot. I didn't, I, mean, I didn't forget all. I went to mechanic school, man. You know, I really, I really did, man. I might. I've lost that piece of information, <laughs> dementia, well, you know, <laughs> that's bad, man, you know, dementia is a terrible thing, man, and I've lost all that, I've lost a lot of that, all of that knowledge, you know, I, I try to dig back in there and get it, man, I don't know, maybe I was messing around with my first wife too much, I wasn't paying attention like I should have been, but, you know, how that goes, <laughs> Uh, I just want to tell you about that I got some married in, in the 30, 30, 33 year man. I worked at the same place he did. I worked there five years. I got fired for a DUI on my on my days off. I had four days off on swing shift back in them days. Swing shift, 749 hour back in the 80s. I was rocking and rolling it, dude. I mean, I could do anything I wanted. You can make $25 an hour. Now you might be comfortable, but... I was pretty comfortable when I made seventeen forty nine that time, but it's just uh it's hard to make it any other time, but um yeah, I had a truck I broke down. I just bought it. I went over there to the ride, they gave me a hundred and twenty six dollars with the cord, you know. I take it. I guess I can't that's hard to get anybody to take me. I tried to get back up there. I left the chains and battery and shit like that in there, you know, and it's bad leaving it up there in town, but I was disgusted with it. All I wanted to do was get home. I was tired. I had to get feed the dogs. Yesterday, I bought dog food. Took it back because I had to take it back because I didn't have enough money. You know, get a loan, you know. I didn't have enough money. It's $103 for the tag. It wouldn't take the tag off of it because I'm not sure... I got a buddy of mine I got to talk to first before we scrap it, you know. I still owe him a little bit on it, and I got—I just can't. I had told the truth, you know. It would be in my big mouth, tell the truth, you know. Well, I got, I'm not sure exactly what I want to do. I mean, it's going to get scrapped probably because it's got to blow the head, you know, blow the motor. Um, I had gas could be all right, but you ain't got the clutch problems, and it's got, it's starting to get a lot of problems on it. It's not, I don't know if it's going to be. Worth it to him or not to, to me. I mean, it's mine, but I, mean, I don't really care about it, you know. I pay him off of it, and 
I scrap it, and you know, but uh, you know, as long as it's uh, titled in, in his name too, you know, we got we send it in together with him and lean on it. So I can't really do nothing. I can't. So I told him I, I got you know. So since I ain't scrapping it, they go. They made me buy a new a new plate. So I had a plate for a day, brand new plate in 19. It's got on it. I think it's gray. If I, I think so. A cop pulled me off one time and said, "Man, you know." That's a 14, you know. It's a, I think it's got a 15. It's orange, man. Cause I just had got my. I was. I got lucky there about. You know, it's not really lucky. It's just that I got a ding. Um, I quit. Um, I didn't show. Uh, well, anyway, not up in the big city, huh? <laughs> well, I'm out here in the boonies. I'm stuck. I'm chugging. Again, I was sitting here thinking about Lisa, and, and this is it's just really, I never, there's not a moment go by, and Lisa, 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 and, and uh, <clears throat> so, <clears throat> I don't know, we're having a hard time getting stuff on YouTube, and it's just, uh, you know, one thing after another, but I thought I'd just, uh, you know, haul at you and let you know about the, the good Samaritans that stopped buying, and the kids, you know, the kids, the young kids, and their days were all in the, you know, in race cars and everything. And, oh, starter, that's what it is, and, you know, and, you know, and, you know, and that's probably what it is. <laughs> and so uh, I, got it, I walked over there to ride. I thought enough of it that I thought what I thought. I thought enough of it that I walked over there and seen how much it is. $126 with core. Um, it's probably where I go, what I do. I could... I have had them golf on me and find out what other prices are somewhere else at their competitors. I didn't give a shit. I, I got it. I want it, but you know how I am. But I probably just go there. But you know, if I could save you know twenty, thirty dollars, I'm gonna go somewhere else. You know, I had them. Uh, I just hate to go down to. I hate to go down there. Uh, well, you know, I can't. I don't know about. I don't even know if John Carter's in it anymore now. I heard he quit doing it, selling shit. You know, so I don't know. I have to go down there and see if he's got any parts there. Eh? And I'll fit my old girl. She's in 97. But, you know, it's a, it's got a badass 5.0 in it. But it's, uh, it's not down right now. It's not down for the count because I got, I got to wait to get paid. Okay. But anyway, here's where we're at, you know, and I'm still here. And, um, I don't know what I don't know what I'm gonna do about it, you know. I really don't. I really, really don't know what to do. You know, I just I don't know what to do. Hopefully, hopefully by the time you see this, um, hopefully by the time you see this, uh, I got a million dollars and we got grandbaby laws everywhere. And, you know, we got the band playing, and you got the cheerleaders, and you got the, you know, and everybody's coming together, you know, and you got, like, uh, God bless America, you know, God bless Lisa, okay? I want everybody to say it, you know, and, and thank you, Lisa, you know, and I want, I, want her, I want to make a day for her, man, a day for her, and a day for all the souls that's with her, you know? We need to make a day. And remember, everyone that was disrespected, they was wanting to be an organ donor, they were disrespected and talked about and tormented and tortured. And then you got the ones that didn't want to be, but they were done that way anyway, such as Lisa. And we want to think about them. And, uh, and let's don't do that anymore. Let's don't talk about people's organs and how much you're going to make off of it. Uh, don't be, you need to keep keep them clean, cleaner than you do. Uh, just because they're in a coma don't mean that they can't hear you, because they can, based on Lisa's dream, they can hear you. Um, and, uh, and don't and don't play God. Don't you dare play God. If they don't want to give up their organs, and there's just some little, some little bitty uh, catch-22 there, like me, Saying no, no, no. Well, that should stop it. It should stop it right there. And when she wakes up, she can beat the heck out of me for letting her live. You know, whatever. I don't care. Okay. But there, there's a catch twenty two there, and there, there, there should be. And that, and that fact that I am her spokesperson, uh, that's the that's the catch you needed, and you should have stopped. 
when I told you to stop. And I'm going to make this a law. If I, every breath I take is going to be for Lisa. And Lisa didn't deserve that. You've done this to her. And any one of my personalities come out and tell you the same damn thing. I showed you that the other night. There's five of us, you know. <laughs> I, I'm not. I'm not going to. It, it makes me laugh. And I, I, I don't. I don't want to cry, and you know, and I don't want to damn, you know, I don't want to do anything to, to um, hurt her soul. And, uh, but I, you know, as you can see, uh, can I kiss you? And that's a, that's a damn thing. That's right. I'm doing the right, I'm going the right way, and I'm doing the right thing for her. And that's right. I think that's a good thing. And, uh, I ain't, well, at least I ain't going to complain about my power being drained anymore, so, you know, unless I find something different, but, anyway, um, Mitchell Aaron O. Senior, 301 Harbert Valley Road, Cole, Georgia, 30577, write me today, and, uh, because right now I don't have nothing, and I need some, I need some input, and I need, I need some rock and roll money, man, let's go, and I need some people to help me. I want to get going on this, man. I want to get. I want to take. I want to down. Um, I want to teach the hospital lesson. I want to teach them that they don't own people and nobody. I want every everybody that works in the hospital and, and every nurse and all the doctors. I want you to think about this. Think about it real, real hard. Even the teachers in the school. You think about this real hard. Maybe we just don't know everything. Okay. And, you know, it just maybe you don't know everything, and uh, so that's why. Uh, Cause uh, based on that, based on her dream, cause she couldn't get no input from me if she's brain dead, like your first doctor said and your second doctor said. I mean, when I went to the corner and put her out, and you know that she was out, and uh, and she got and the last thing she remember was the lab. You know, she was talking about the lab, and side by side with the old man, she was cold. But you know, as you know, she got that mixed up. Cause that was the last thing, and she, in her dream, the last thing was about her son. And she said her son, or maybe she didn't want to tell me about her son, but, but she said it anyway. But it was at the end. Maybe, uh, maybe you know, she had skipped over that, so that's why uh, I, I asked her. You know, I wanted her to write and leave me a, leave me, you know, write it down, write it down. I took it. I write everything down. I said, write, write it down, write it down. You know, because I do. I write everything down. And I told her to write it down, but I haven't found it any yet. I thought she put it in a jar or something like that. I can't find it anywhere. But anyway, write me today. Tell me what's on your mind, and I'll tell you what's on mine. Okay, bye.